joined by uh, g and &E centre forward Matty Gillum. Uh, Matty, first question, obviously, how's how's the back after having to come off injured today? Yeah, it's not, it's not too bad. Um, I think it's just just a bit of a niggle. Um, and like I've said to some other people tonight, that I just felt like someone else could give a bit more up there. Um, obviously, trying to see the game out, so uh, that that was my decision, sort of, to come off. So, so, uh, so three games in under the under the new manager. How, how are you finding life under the um, under the new manager? Yeah, yeah, thoroughly enjoying it. Um, we're doing well. We've obviously unbeaten in three, um, two wins. Uh, obviously, I scored on Thursday night, um, and there's a good mood around the camp at the minute, and we've just got to keep it going. Absolutely, and you were key in the involvement to the uh, to, to, to the goal today. Some great hold-up play, and obviously you played Bevan in to, to kind of cross and how he scores. A great combination play for the for the front three to get to get a goal between you. Yeah, I, I've been speaking to Bev quite regularly, especially on Thursday night. I think by the start of the game Thursday, there wasn't really much support around me when we were getting the ball forward. But tonight, he was nice and tight, nice and close. As soon as I got it, rolled it to him and he's putting a great ball, to be fair. And Harry, he's done really well to get in front of his man and, and put it in the net. Today was the, the, the first time in 14 games that we've kept a, a clean sheet. And uh, just talking to the manager before, he, he obviously mentioned the fact of consistency. I think, I think one of the first times that we've seen a consecutive back back four and, and the same keeper play uh, in, in two games. So just talk a little bit to us about, about the five guys at the back there and, and the work they put in today to get that clean sheet for us. Yeah, I think they've been crucial. Um, I think we've probably been unlucky. We've given away a couple of bad goals pre in the prior two games to start. And we probably could have had two, three clean sheets out of three. Um, but they've been fantastic at the back. They, they shouldn't have had to defend like that because we should have been 2-3 up today. Um, but when they've been asked to defend, it's been shown tonight that we can do it. Um, there was no silly mistakes and we defended really well. So it's just a case of keeping it going now and hopefully we go Tuesday night on another game, clean sheet and a win. Keep the momentum going. Two, two centre backs are obviously a little bit camera shy because he wouldn't come out and talk to me. But what, what's, the, what, what's the communication like uh, in the back four? Is, it, is, that, is that a key part of keeping the clean sheet today? Yeah, I think definitely. I, th I think we've got good legs in there as well. You know, it's a young back four essentially. Um, DB obviously brings a bit more experience in there. And but they all, they all talk. You can hear Finn. You can hear LB. And and they, sh they show with the commanding headers and, and things like that. Um, and that that shows us up. And the momentum is a is a key attribute in football obviously we move forward to, to four home games now two in the league and two in different cup competitions how, how important is it to kind of build on the on, on the on the past three games that we've had yeah of course we need to build on it um in recent times the home form's not been great so um it'd be good to put a run together now in these next four at home um and like you say the momentum we can stay on a high while we're winning keep it going um and hopefully we'll get another another few wins under the belt. Fantastic. Well, hope the back heals quickly and hope that we see you uh, out there playing soon. Yeah, thanks very much. Cheers, Matty. Bye. Cheers.